I think I'm good. Do I have troops I need to move? Do I have things I need to repair? Do I have things I can build? Nope, there's no PP. PP. Do I want to stress Joffrey again? <laughs> Probably. Do I want to do it now? Sure, let's hit the French. Maybe get them to suffer some casualties. Split their forces. I, I need to destroy this unit so I can close the front, because <laughs> I'm using one, two, three, three infantry, well, three, three units to hold the front line. <laughs> that was dangerous. That was dangerous. I, I told you the AI is fucking good enough. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's good enough. Where are these? Yeah. I saw you coming there. <laughs> I was asking, where are those, those Frenchmen? All right, so we killed the submarine. Yay! Good for us. Uh, I need you guys to go repair, by the way. There goes my PP, because you're the only boats I have, and I'm not gonna be building boats anytime soon. Please heal. Cool. And if you could just come out and play. <laughs> ah, damn! I forgot. I need to move the boats. The boats can only enter the harbor. If you have boats in the harbor, the merchant convoy cannot enter the harbor. Then it's gonna take longer to get your pee pee. Pee pee! I will not never get tired of saying pee pee. Oh wow, it actually came out. Ow, ow, ow. Ooh, crap. Okay. Do they have a dreadnought or a pre dreadnought up here? I'm not sure. Well, the good news is. Uh, the Russians are out. The bad news is, ouch, my merchant convoy. <laughs> All right. It's fine. Really? <laughs> that cunning bastard. <laughs> oh, you're moving on infantry there? I'm gonna move them that way. <laughs> Stop attacking my guys. It's annoying. Cool. Oh, they're running out of PP. They can't repair. They cannot repair. They cannot reinforce the troops. Good! Very good! Alright, could you die? Please die. <laughs> Ay, God damn, that's a, that's a nasty place to be and I can't take Antwerp. The, the good news is I can just keep nailing on them until they lose the entire efficiency and die that way. It's just gonna take a long while. The also good news is that the AI doesn't know how to use bombardment. At this point, I would have sent all my boats to shell these guys. Oh, hello! French air power. This mine is kind of busy somewhere else. It is fine. All right, it looks like they're abandoning the, the ideas of going north, which is fine for me. I would have preferred if I could encircle that one, but you know, when it's fine, it's fine. Oh god. Central power ports located. The, the Antant have intercepted merchant shipping heading for central power ports and established a blockade. The convoy routes will remain blocked until the Antant's domination of the high seas is broken. Damn it, there was something there. Uh, broke bug the event. The Goban. Turkey goes to war. That's the Goban going to the... To Turkey and Turkey. Well, it's not Turkey. It's the Ottoman Empire still. And then the Ottoman Empire is uh, joining Central Powers. Cool. Which is gonna suck for us, because... <laughs> oh, God damn it. Because we're gonna have to fight in the worst possible place ever. In the history of ever. Hello. Welcome to the worst possible place in the history of possible ever. You do not belong here. Yeah, the British are actually gonna focus on this side of the war for some goddamn reason. We're gonna keep these troops, cause Arab revolts, remember. And we're gonna maybe gonna go hello and get uh And get Russia something to think about, like losing this front is gonna be shit, but it exists, so you know. Alright, also there's no railway there, so <laughs> it's gonna take a while. It is gonna take, take a while to get there. Um, it'll be fine, probably. Also, the Turkish forces are shit. And their production is shit. Oh, there's also Gallipoli over there. We don't want people landing at Gallipoli, just you know. 
So we have the Ottoman cruiser over here, the Gobin. We'll have the Lion cruiser over here. And we're gonna move about. <laughs> to reinforce this, this Latiara. This is why I was saying, maybe I wanna move over here and harass the British. I'm not sure what I wanna do. Yet. Probably wanna drop troops here and just annoy these guys. So you can go to the harbor. And annoy me. You can build more of these and annoy me. You can build more of this and annoy me. Cool. I mean, we have enough forces to just hold this line. There's no way we can attack here. We need to get across a canal, a channel, take Poseidon and take Ismailian. It's um, problematic. <laughs> you for now can stay there. We're the only one who can actually move in the Dardanelles. The Russians can't come past here, the British can't come here, unless they take Gallipoli, I think. And it's fine. Pretty sure the... The British don't want to land at Gallipoli yet. <laughs> yet. Alright. What did you say we want to do? Fail. Yeah, fail. Fail sounds good. I'm going to bombard these guys and push them out. It's just going to be a slog. It's not going to give me any advantage yet, so... Go here. In the name of the king, please die. Go. Yeah, Acceptable. Fine. Use the air power to harass these guys and maybe give them something to think about. I heard you want to die. That would be nice. Cool. That's actually very cool for us. No. <laughs> I should actually move these guys, but eh, can't move the cannons anyway. We have broken the line. Not really, but we have broken pieces of the line. Nah, it's fine. It's fine. Destroy one infantry brigade. That's very fine. And two garrisons. Also fine. We don't have any artillery here yet, but we do have the air power. We might be able to do it. Unlikely. So, you know, just have things come. There's another major problem. All right, <laughs> the big fight. Uh, where is your dreadnought? Because I need to kill it. Hello, pre-dreadnought. I mean, you bastard better leave my boat alone. That's what a battleship does to pre-dreadnought. Cool. Uh, submarines. The submarine is gonna sink my shit. I just can. I can see it happening. Come on, boat, you can do it. Even if you die, it will be fine. The motherland is with you. It's fine. Oh, um, all you need to do, boat, is technically move over there. I believe it might be able to do it before the Russians attack. Maybe. And yeah, can't attack him. Because it hasn't. Uh, I wasn't next to it when it attacked. Yay for shit. Come on. You can do it, Merchant Convoy. I believe in you. <laughs> Not really, no. No, I don't. Alright, could you maybe die? Oh. What do you know? Go away. You don't need to heal. Cavalry needs to go here. Um, I don't see why I shouldn't just move up the line to new and interesting places. Oh, that's a problem. That is a problem. Because I can't heal it anymore. Alright. We continue with the hill that is the battle for Antwerp. We might be able to do it now, though. Come on, man. Fine. Next time. <laughs> Alright. Could you fucking please go away? Thank you. My god. Victory. We have saved our flank. It was... It almost died, but we have saved it. Joffrey, do you want to suffer some more? Next time, maybe? Okay. Sure, I guess. Ow! Well, that went well. <laughs> that went well. It has gone well. Ish. Alright, we have two more infantry troops. Yeah, Russia. It, it is going to be Russia. It has to be Russia. 
It's fine in Russia at the moment. Another turn for another infantry unit. I think I need... Nah, it's fine. We're not gonna attack anymore, basically. We're just gonna form a line of infantry and deal with it in garrison. We're gonna keep attacking Antwerp, yeah, sure, but it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Must need to move this artillery here. I should have moved it before. Alright, um... Do you guys wanna come out and play, maybe? <laughs> Send your troops over the sea now? Alright, do I have anything I need to worry about? Like horrible Russians attacking me. <laughs> Listen, I mean I mean this from the point of view of the Germans and the Australians. The Russians are coming! No! Um, yeah, sure, why not? Hello. Shorter line is a better line. I don't want to do this in the future when I have troops. I do not have troops yet. Well, I think I do. I also want to do this for now, because I might just want to go here and take Venistia. This is where the, most of the fun is going to happen. This is where most of the Russian troops are. So we could go there and extend extend the front to ridiculous... <laughs> to ridiculous size. Man, nah. We're just going to focus on... And the Vilnia bracelet of pocket. We're gonna need to. If we surround these guys here and destroy a lot of them, we'll have an open road, more or less, towards Moscow. Which is all the way over there. Speaking of, I forgot it. Sorry. Before I forget, information commander Ra Reinhard Scheer excels in brilliant maneuvering, keeping his head cool in battle and considering the survival and protection of his fleet as his primary objective. Cool. Everything else, next time. Thank you for watching, comrades. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you like, and if you have questions, let me know. And I will try to answer them to the best of my abilities. The war is going well. We have kicked Belgium out of the fight. Technically, they can't... They cannot get any more PPs. Well, they still have Antwerp. Never mind, we haven't kicked it yet. Soon! Soon. Uh, we've broken the Serbian defensive lines. Barely. But we have inflicted casualties, we haven't taken casualties. Well, we have taken casualties, we just haven't lost entire divisions. <laughs> and we've uh, inflicted some casualties on the Russians and held them fast. It's all good! And we also have our all of our cavalry alive. Unfortunately, yeah, that's a swap. <laughs> we'll see what happens next time.